Hi friends, in this tutorial we'll uh, develop a simple uh, application to demonstrate a pagination using Spring Boot. For this I'm going to take reference of my website javainews.com. So let's go to the Spring Boot section. So in one of the previous tutorial, we had implemented Spring Data using uh, Spring Boot where we had persisted data in the H2 database and then later retrieved it. This data we had retrieved uh, in the uh, JSP pages. So in this example, we'll again persist the data using JPA uh, to the H2 database. And then we'll retrieve this data uh, to demonstrate how pagination uh, is used in uh, Spring Boot. So let's begin with the implementation. So this is the project structure that we'll be creating. Go to Eclipse and create a Maven project. We'll add the dependencies to the form. So go to your Goya and uh, select these dependencies. So, the dependencies that we are using are the Spring Boot Starter Data JP and the Spring Boot Starter Web. We are also using the Spring Boot Dev Tools. The Spring Boot Dev Tool it provides us a UI for the H2 database, which uh, for which we are going to use the uh, to insert the data. So let's create the Spring Boot Hello World application class. Next, we'll create the entity class employee. Uh, we have also uh, annotated this with the JPA tags. Next, we define the controller, employee controller. Here, uh, we have used uh, the uh, parameter here for the method as pageable, Spring Boot pageable. Next, we'll have to define the employee repository class. Let's build this application now. Next, we'll start this as a Java application. So our application has started successfully. 
uh, as I had mentioned before that Spring Boot Dev Tool uh, Dev Tools it provides a UI interface for the H2 database. So using that, we'll ins insert some data into uh, our H2 database, and uh, then we'll retrieve that data to demonstrate pagination. So go to the URL that is mentioned here, H2 console. Here we will have to give the JDBC URL as JDBC colon h2 colon mem colon test db. So give this URL and click on connect. So here we can see that the employee table it has been created because we had mentioned the tags uh, for the employee model class. Currently there will be no data here for the employee class. So click on edit and add the data here. So now that uh, the data has been inserted in the database, H2 database, we will demonstrate pagination. For this we will mention the page size that we want. Currently we want three elements and we want this to be sorted on the basis of name parameter. So open this URL. So here we can see that total three elements have been returned number of elements 3 and also the sorting it has been done on the basis of name parameter name 2, name 3, name 4 so we have successfully demonstrated pagination using Spring Boot uh, you can download the source code from here hope you have understood this tutorial thanks